Yeah, it's never a fucking story. You never fucking heard. I know. No, I was just fucking remembering. Oh, come on. Right. <laughs> Back in the day, when I lived in Pedo, <laughs> I was around my mate's house, like, when I, we were getting stoned and that. And this bird called Charlie fucking turned up. Oh, fucking hell, I like her. <laughs> Hang on, I better get a bit closer to this one, because... You might not hear me because my voice is wankered. Oh, no. <coughs> but yeah, no, I oh, fucking like her. And I, I went, where'd you live? Out, out the road. And I went, oh, I'll walk you home because I live right next door, dear love. <laughs> I know, I lived in the next block of flats, which is really strange, but, ah, oh, look, ah, oh, fuck, no, nah, no, nah, that was weird, how that fucking ended up, but, uh, obviously, I uh, ended up in a fucking place, <coughs> and, uh, yeah, no, we had a bit of fun and that, oh, yeah, we tried it on my, I, I was, just moved into my flat and all I had was a settee, so <laughs> yeah, yeah, we had it on that. <laughs> but that's a different story. But no, 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 she, she gave me gonorrhea, but I, we won't go into that either. But the next time I met her was a, I know, a couple of years later. I was running a drug dealer, fucking getting some fucking dope, you know what I mean? Like, and it was my birthday. I was fucking a little bit off. I was pissed up and to wreck. <laughs> I left the drug dealers. The fucking got them. She goes, oh, I'll follow you. She was going to come back to mine and give me a birthday present. Well, she did give me a birthday present, but it was a little bit different than I wanted. <coughs> Uh, but yeah, now I fucking forgot to put a side stand up on my bike. So when we got the first corner, I hit the fucking side stand. Ah, oh, fuck it. I fucking, fucking slid straight into one of those. Fuck it. I slid straight into a hedge. I grazed up all my armpit real bad. Ah, oh, fucking hell, did it sting. And like, she picked me up off the floor and she goes, You all right? I looked at my bike and I went, bike's all right. Yeah, no, I'm all right. Well, I, you know, ow. I'm a bit, I'm a bit fucked up. <laughs> yeah, I know. You really don't want to slice your armpit up. Ah, oh, fucking hell. Uh, stung like shit. Yeah, I sliced my side up a bit. But went back to mine. <laughs> Yeah, I wasn't living in Penn only. And uh, oh, she patched me up, <laughs> sorted me out, <laughs> fucked off. Oh, fuck <sighs> off. A few weeks later, my dick started it. She, oh, she ain't giving me fucking penal warts as well. Oh, it's like you're fucking joking. Ah, oh, you dirty little fucking whore. You really fucked me up now. So. <laughs> oh, no, they'll come back to haunt me a year later. <laughs> oh, no. Fuck, shit. I didn't expect that. Well, I know. It's one of them weird things. <laughs> It'll... Yeah, no, the story of one day I went up to the hospital, got treated, and you got to wash it off, you know, and I went down the rifle and got pissed, and I fucking left it a bit too long, and my fucking dick ended up on fire, and got caught washing it in the sink in the pub. But no, no, that's just fucking crazy stories. But I was a dirty little bastard, you know what I mean? Like, ah, oh, fuck off. I couldn't help myself. Now I'm a dirty old man. <laughs> Happy days. 
No, I know. Uh, crap. <coughs> yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> Sorry. I know that. No, I know. I got no secrets. I'll tell the truth. I don't give a fuck. <coughs> you know. Fucking hell, I got crabs from a fucking hotel bed and I did him that well, you know, and I, I did blame it on, on a bird because I thought I got a rough herb, so that didn't go that well either. Yeah, yeah, I know. I was a dirty little cunt, all right. I like sex with women as long as I'm up for it. I know, stupid thing, isn't it? I like love. I make, 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 like making love. Nothing wrong with that. And I'm going to love and leave you because I'm getting a 555.